the history of the Academy and the evolution of the history of film have different parallels in between. In the 1920s, the movies had captured the imagination of the world, but until the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Science was formed, no one organized the people of the movies uh, in a single group as a real force. By the end of the 20s, the American film companies were producing over 500 feature length films and a hundred of short subjects. All of them were 100 million people in 23,000 theaters across the US. In that period was when performance began, which brought the idea of having an organization encompassing the old movie makers. The government usually had a critical view on Hollywood, something that occurred along the years, sometimes during the 20s, or asking for a diverse subjects before or after the Second World War or sometimes in a sincere disagree with uh, speeches, jokes, or different kinds of propaganda. So there was a new trend toward unionism. In November of 1926, a studio basic agreement was signed between the nine film studios and unions representing electricians, carpenters, stagehands, and musicians. Technological advances were being made by various studios, but each one of them kept their secrets as to manufacturing, to produce, or distribution films. So they needed a place to exchange for ideas, a common ground where the new ideas and the development of all the new advances and equipment could be discussed or shared for the benefit of the industry. It was in January 1927, during a Sunday night at the beach home of the MGM studio chief Louis Vimeo, that during a conversation with Conrad Nagel, uh, Fred Niblo, Henry King, John Stahl and different filmmakers, when they were agreed of creating an organization to solve technological problems, labor disputes and the spring content. 36 people gathered at the Ambassador Hotel in January 11, 1927, and it was not until May 11 at the Billmore Hotel in Los Angeles where 230 persons joined to the new Academy as pioneer members. The first words corresponded to the first president, Douglas Fairbanks, who said, our purpose is positive not negative. We are formed to do, not undo. The statement of that meeting was published in June 1927. The Academy will promote harmony and solidarity among the membership and among the different branches. It will reconcile internal differences that may exist or arise. It will encourage the improvement and advancement of the arts and science uh, of the profession. One of the primary reasons for the formation of the Academy is opening its facilities to outside organizations and groups of meetings, advanced screenings of unreleased motion pictures uh, for the benefit of opinion makers in the community, uh, plus educational and different institutions. For instance, in 1930, leading representatives of the Russian film industry met Hollywood executives and technicians to exchange ideas and knowledge. When the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Science was organized in 1927, 
Among the several committees formed was one named Awards of Merit. By 1928, interest in the wars had been revived, and in July, the Academy Board authorized 12 categories and an, an early event. They decided to limit the nominations, as they called them, to achievements uh, in pictures and five boards of judges, uh, one for each academy branch, were appointed to consider uh, the nominations. The following general rule was uh, Academy Awards of Merit shall be bestowed for achievements in connection with motion pictures, first publicly exhibited by means of 35 mm film or larger for paid admission in a commercial motion picture theater in Los Angeles area defined West Los Angeles and Beverly Hills, such exhibition being for a consecutive run of no less than a week.